Good morning, y'all. I know it's been a long time since my last upload, but I've been working on this shed with David. We had to do sheetrock painting. Um, David did the trim. And yeah, we still gotta fix electricity in here. <laughs> Might look like we have electricity, but we actually have a drop cord. See? Kinda ghetto right now. That's okay. Rosie's my little butch though. It's like, 7:30 in the morning none of the kids are awake yet it's the weekend and we have jace kaiser ensley here marissa's at her mom's as usual so stop asking me where marissa is because she's usually at her mom's house um yeah i kind of look crazy right now because i don't have no makeup on but yeah i wanted to show you guys my shed and also want to give you guys a little update what I've been up to lately, I think. I don't know. So lately, I've been just working on the shed with David, and um, the kids have been going to school. Nothing really interesting. So David, he took the boys hunting yesterday. He's taking the boys hunting again today. Hopefully it doesn't rain. Um, other than that, we have a major problem here that I just want to discuss. It's my dog, Junior. He keeps trying to run away to the neighbor's house because there's females there. And uh, yeah, so we have to keep going to get him, which is kind of aggravating. But then people keep asking like, where's Junior? And if you're wondering where Junior is, he's running around. <laughs> we don't chain our dogs and we bring him in at nighttime. He was in all night. And then as soon as we let him out, boom, back to the neighbor's house, he went. So David will have to go look for him later. We have to go retrieve him almost every day from the neighbor's house. Um, and if we put him on a chain, he'll break it. And we really don't like the idea of a dog chain for dogs. We just, we like to let ours run wild because we have so much land here. So why not? And um, Rosie, she doesn't run away. She stays right beside me all the time. It's crazy. That's sort of an annoying problem we've been dealing with lately, but we're just going to see where this vlog takes us today. I don't know what the point is going to be about it, but we're just going to keep filming. And um, let's go make some coffee because I need it. Come on, Rose. Go ahead. Okay. Oh, girl. Yeah, see? Everything's a mess right now. Hi, Mrs. Kitty. Mamas. You guys want to see this crazy spider? He's been chilling here. Hold on. No, don't touch this. I'm trying to get a spider. It won't focus. It won't focus on the spider. Yo, it looks really... <gasps> there we go. Aw, ah. oh, you guys are sweethearts. Rosie, she loves you. David's still working on the trim, like I was telling you guys. That's our burn pit, by the way, for cardboard boxes. It's gloomy out today. It's probably gonna be like this all day. So I don't know what we're gonna end up doing today. What, Rosie? Rosie, 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 leave your cat alone. You leave that kitty alone. Throw your bike in the yard. When I tell him, pick it up every day. Hi, Mom. What are you doing? Uh, Where's Jace? Uh, he's in the room sleeping. He's still sleeping? Well, he's actually not, because I keep hearing the phone on, so he's not sleeping at all. What are you playing? Skateboard 3. Skateboarding game? And sleep. Can you turn on Lizzie's light for me? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, she's shedded. You know what that means? Yeah. She's getting bigger. Yeah. See her tail? It's shedding. I know, the skin is coming off. She's so tired. The skin is <laughs> Mommy, it is. She usually lays up there, but she's not right now. The pool is looking much better. I gotta scrub it. So David cut our lawn, and you see all the grass? 
I should have swept it away and I didn't. So we went in our skimmers and then turned our pool green. But I put a bunch of chlorine in there and now I just gotta scrub a little bit. Oh, yay, yay. It's either the water's too high, the water's too low, the skimmers are blocked and I don't know. <laughs> Always something. They don't have to chop your legs off. What do you have to do? What are you talking about? I'm playing the skateboard game and every time you like get hurt and you take and you die, it either shows like more of you got hurt or it's red, then if you broke it, if it's Well if you broke your foot, it can still heal. Yeah. This Unless you break it really bad, then you'll get surgery, but they're not gonna chop your legs off. Look at my cute little coffee mug. And it says, bless. It's pretty cute. So we're going to make some coffee. Oh, wait, did I put... I can check my video, but I think I just put a pot in there. I'm not sure. <laughs> Into my curry. All right, I guess I did. I'm guessing I did. Okay, now I'm paranoid about it. Okay, it's dry. <laughs> I do that almost every morning. Preheating. Give me my coffee, give me my coffee, give me my coffee. Oh, I just got Rosie excited. Not like y'all ask, but do you want to see my coffee bar and what I have? Let me show you. <laughs> so this is regular sugar because, and there's a little bit of coffee grounds in there. Don't worry, it's not dirty. Um, but yeah, I have a little bit of coffee in case I run out of creamer because I use coffee. This is some caramel that nobody has used at all because none of us like it. <laughs> um, a little cute coffee spoon for scooping things. Now, if you use liquid coffee, I mean, if you use liquid creamer and you run out, get you some of this. This is that dehydrated powder. So then you always have it. And if you run out of coffee pods, get yourself some instant coffee oh we need more get yourself some instant coffee and as long as you set it up all like this you'll have everything you need for a long time and then i put my little pods down here and then this is david's hot sauce collection as yeah, you can see like yeah he does like hot sauce i know, I know it's too hot can I just show you how organized my fridge is real quick? Like, Marissa did this. Props to Marissa. She did a good job. Except David did this. This is a TikTok hack to uh, make your asparagus last longer. Boiled peanuts. Yeah, everything she put in the containers. She scrubbed all this down. It just looks so organized, doesn't it? And yes, I know. I have a big, big, big fridge. It's like really big <laughs> this is a uh, what is it whirlpool brand and i don't even think they offer it anymore i got this with the house it came with our house in 2017 and as you can see it fits right into the wall which saves a lot of space there was what, what did you say about breakfast i said there was corn out in the uh field do you think you guys might get a deer? Mm, yeah. Maybe. Well, I can get a super deer. You can get a super deer? Yeah. Okay. That's not dad. What you doing? Got something special for it. Oh, God, what? It's for my sweet. Beautiful ladies, because I love you. Oh, God, you scared me. Thank you, babe. You're so nice. For you too, babe. It's wildflowers. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Smell. Is it beautiful? Yeah. Thank you, babe. Mm -hmm. I just walked so far. You did? Yeah, like two miles, probably. Did you catch anything? No. Catch? Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't shoot. 
So yeah, I'm just filming a little vlog. Don't know where it's gonna take us today, but we'll see. Thank you. Jace is awake, y'all. Sorry, I've been making a, been making a vlog while you've been sleeping. Yeah. <laughs> but we are going to get some food, so I'll tune in with you guys when we get there. Y'all, we're back home. Jace is closing the gate. Thank you. Yep. You're welcome. So we ended up going to the gas station to get breakfast sandwiches and we just thought this was going to be an easy process but it was actually very hectic. So we went to the gas station and that's where we get like hot breakfast food in the morning sometimes because there's not enough eggs to cook, there's no sausage, there's no, there's no bacon at the house, I need to go grocery shopping. So we went to the gas station and the first gas station we went to we walked in and i was about to film and they're like oh it's closed i'm like okay let's go to the other one so we get to the other gas station that has hot food and um you know we walk in and we get a bunch of breakfast sandwiches we go to check out so when we go to check out um i use my paypal i have a paypal debit card so that's what i was using and it says literally on my card the expiration date is the year 2023 so i was like you know i have you know funds on this account i'm gonna use it so i try to use this freaking card and let me tell you they say denied i'm like okay maybe it's the wrong pin so i do a different pin they say denied i'm like dude what's going on right now is something wrong with my card so they're like charge it as credit i charge it as credit didn't go through i'm like hold on let me go get my other bank card and there was five people in line and waiting behind me. And I was like, dude, this is so embarrassing right now. And yes, they didn't know who I was. So it was even more embarrassing because everyone was staring at me. So then I went and got my other card and paid for it. Then I called PayPal just now on the way home. This is why I didn't film any of this because I was like freaking out. I had anxiety so bad. So then I called PayPal and they're like, this card has been closed out since July. I'm like, who did that? They're like, PayPal. I'm like, why? They're like, uh, was there a dispute with you? I'm like, no, there wasn't any dispute with me. They're like, oh, well, sorry, we'll issue you a new card. So PayPal just canceled my card for no reason. Thanks for letting me know, y'all. That was just super great. Thanks. Um, no, but really, I have been very frustrated with PayPal lately. And I don't know if you guys have had the same problems as me but every time I get paid for something and it gets put on hold and it's like the past three times I've gotten paid it's been put on hold and I don't know why and PayPal's starting this new thing now where it has to do with the IRS and taxes and now they're gonna report everything from PayPal so anyways um new biden laws but yeah that's what happened to me um yeah just i had to tell you guys because there's gonna be a big gap in why i didn't feel getting food but anyways we got food let's go in jace yes, let's I'm give hungry. them the goods And I got some chicken tendies. For what? what? Well, you guys, listen, listen, listen. There's a lot of laundry behind you. <laughs> yeah, we need to fold that. Now we're outside. Everyone ate breakfast. Second round of coffee, thank God. And we're gonna go see what the kids are doing. Uh-oh. See? They're always in some shit that they shouldn't be in. Look, they got a whole playground, but they're gonna go in there. We're gonna get a new zip line soon. Yes, please get a brand new zip line. Yeah, please get, please, make sure it has makeup on it. Whoa, Ooh, the chickies are getting big. No, 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 Kaiser, we're not going in there. Because they'll go running out. Kaiser, no. Okay, I know. I want to No, no, but you can't I can't. Let's go. I'm just filming. Look, she's pulling the camera at you. 
Don't step in that ant pile. Okay, that mound of sand. Kaiser! All right, then you're just gonna get bit by red ants. Mommy, what? There's no ants on me at all. That's why Ooh, watch out for that sand pile. <laughs> Daddy, I, I didn't feel my feet right there, did I? And it's my turn. I want to see all you? the grass in this spot since yesterday. Daddy. I just moved this here yesterday. No, 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 no. Oh, we're not going to play right now. No, no, no. Oh, I'm not going for a walk yet. Go for a walk later. Oh, watch out. That one's got crushed, dude. <laughs> all right, now watch when I move it. We're going to start eating all this grass. What? Guys, we're going to start by the air pile. I won't. No, no, watch out, too. Let me try. Stop arguing. What are you doing? Oh He's trying to move it. Why? Giving them new grass. They yeah. eat grass. They'll eat grass. Yeah, look at them. They're already eating it. Oh, they're so happy. Look at how fuzzy, look how fuzzy the rooster's head is. Mm -hmm. The only rooster we have in here is the white one. Yep. And um, what kind were these, babe? Um, yeah. I'll get them some food, though. Rhode Island Reds? No. I don't know. But we got these ones from Tractor Supply. Oh, babe, did you put water in the duck eggs? No. We got duck oh, eggs incubating. You're gonna do that the other day. Cutie hearts. Oh, look at the rooster. Don't touch her. He's like, look at me, look at me. He's so cute. It's so cute. It's so windy. All oh, the leaves falling. See the leaves falling? So these are some duck eggs that we have incubating out in the shop. I got them on eBay. I got a batch of six from Pennsylvania, and then I got another batch of six from somewhere else. We're gonna we're gonna um, intertwine the boys and girls from each batch to make sure they're not from the same breed. Basically, I don't know if it matters. I don't think it matters, but that's kind of nasty if you think about duck brothers and sisters having babies. That's weird. So we're not doing that, but um, we've been incubating them for, I don't know, two weeks now. Has tw It's on day 20, no, 27 days left. And it has to be at 99.5 and the humidity level has to be up to, I think 75 or 80%, which if you Google it, you can figure out how to incubate your own eggs. This incubator we got wasn't that much money and actually you can grow all the way up to turkey eggs so it's pretty cool it turns by itself it has an automatic turning system so we don't have to really do anything we just keep adding water to it every day which david just went to go get water because the humidity the humidity level has to stay up so in order for it to stay up you have to keep water in it but these are my babies are these supposed to be covered i don't know this incubator is kind of old as you can see we're trying to keep the humidity level at the right temperature, but we have to cover all these holes. I don't know why this one came with holes. Probably shouldn't get this kind of incubator or don't get this brand. I like this kind of incubator because it's not that expensive. And when you go online, incubators can get really expensive. So try to find a styrofoam one. It's not that much money. I think when David gets back over here with the water and after we put it in, we can candle light these for you guys because they've been in here for so long and we can see how much they developed or if they're even developing. I hope they are. Usually they are. Usually this incubator does good. All right, so we just put the water in there and we're gonna check some of these. What is he? Ooh, 
That one's working, it looks like. I see veins. I hope so. I never candled uh, duck eggs before, so I don't know. Nice. Nice. So you see in the egg, it's like almost, dude, This these are gonna hatch. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Little babies, it's working, it's working, high five. <laughs> Y'all, I just sat here for the past hour and a half doing laundry. That whole couch was just piled up to the top. It was crazy. Now everyone's taking a peanut break. Peanuts, peanuts, peanuts. Yum. Yum, Mm-hmm. Ooh, I didn't, I didn't dad did some dishes. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Dad. I'm gonna give you a peanuts break. <laughs> You're dumb. <laughs> so that I'd clean more. So I guess today's just a cleaning day. Yum, David's gonna eat some salsa. Make some salsa, my bad. So we got some avocados, got some cilantro, and some hot jalapeno peppers, and onion. <laughs> Don't try that. Yeah, that's the one chip challenge. Don't David, he did that. He'll post his TikTok later, or by the time this is posted, he probably already posted it. Go check it out. It's crazy. So what do we do now? Each other. <laughs> I need some lunch, but we don't got any groceries early. We got plenty of stuff. You just don't want to make it. You got leftovers from yesterday. Yeah. Some I want a burger. You had a burger yesterday. I know. I want another one. The burgers I've been making are off the hook lately. You don't even know. I can scrub the pool. And probably not. Because it's not pool weather right now. I mean, it is Sunday. Yeah, it is a Sunday. We should just be relaxing. But I got the laundry done. Y'all, that laundry... It's been sitting there for a couple days, so <laughs> just kidding, not a couple days. <laughs> Way longer than that, but <laughs> we got it done. And there's a lot more that's in there and drying. Yeah, there really isn't much to do. It's such a gloomy day outside and just been hanging out with the kids. They've been kind of aggravating, but once they saw that I was cleaning, they're like, ooh, let me help mom clean. So that was a little bit helpful. They went and cleaned their rooms. So yeah, it's just been a cleaning day for us, really. A little afternoon pick-me-up. So we're back here in the shed. And I think I'm just going to wrap up this vlog because, you know, really we're not going to do anything the rest of the day. And we're just going to be here hanging out at the house. But um, I just want to say one thing to y'all. I'm kind of going to be a motivational speaker here for a second. But... If someone tells you you can't fucking do something by yourself and you're beating yourself up like, I can't do this. I can't do this. There's no way I can do this by myself. No matter what it is in your life, you can do it. And sometimes it's not going to be done until you get it done. So I just want to put that out there because <laughs> this shed is almost done. And I literally told myself... There's no way I'm gonna finish this shed. There's no way I'm gonna get my life together. Um, I felt lost, you know, after leaving the show and I just finally feel at peace and I finally feel happy with life. And I feel like I'm actually doing more work than I've ever done. I know, I know, you guys are like, oh, filming isn't really a job. It is, but it isn't and I get what you're saying. But, you know, I've done so much physical work in this, shed and it's almost done for podcasting so stay tuned because that's going to be coming up very soon and i'm um, gonna have episodes rolling out and youtube videos i know i've kind of taken a break from youtube 
that's only because I've been working on this shed so hard with David. And um, yeah, don't let anyone crush your dreams or tell you you can't do anything by yourself because you can do it. If you don't have anywhere to do a podcasting room, make it happen yourself. Seriously. I hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing fantastic. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.